Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome with a new Clipsat video. Today we have uh, an important principle uh, of Euler. We learn about that right now. Please, before we start, like, share, subscribe, comment, and turn on notification. Uh, our problem, as you see here, that we have uh, some geometric figures. You can invent any shape you want. And we need to decide whether of these two shapes can be drawn with a single stroke, okay? One stroke. Don't raise your pen of the paper during drawing it. Don't go on the same edge twice. You can intersect your, the, the straight line you are drawing, but never the same edge twice, okay? Uh, feel free to pause that, draw that on a paper and try to make it with this condition. Never go on the same edge twice. Pause, think, and then back again to try to understand the concept of solving these figures. Okay, now uh, we, we need to decide before what is an even or odd points, any figure, any figure, any geometric figure, when you draw some lines that intersect, it might intersect like this. Now I will count this point. How many lines go into that point? I have here one line, two line, three, four lines. Since there are four or six or eight, I know you know even numbers, we will call this even point, okay? If the figure contains only even points with any number of points, that will be possible to be drawn. Like a figure like this. Here, all the vertices of the square, all of them are even points because only for two edges are joining each point, like here, one, two, one, two, okay, for each point. Even if you draw a circle, okay, with a square in it, that can be still solved because it has only even points. This point here is even, this point here is even, this point here is even, and this one as well. So it can be drawn, starting from any of these points and end at the same point again, okay? But the odd points, if the figure have odd points like this one, when only three edges or five edges meets there. So this point here called odd points. Like a shape like this, if I have a circle with a straight line outside the circle. So I have two odd points here, two odd points. Yes, the starting point here is an odd because only one edge is going here. And this one is also an odd because three edges going there. One, two, three. So you need to start from one of the odd points and the end at the other. If we start from here, for example, and go all the way and that, we can draw the shape. But if you start any other way, you cannot draw that without going on the same edge twice. For example, if you start from this point here, you go that way, okay, and go there, oops, you are not allowed to back. You are not allowed to go back. So we failed if we start with another point other than the old point. And the maximum number of points that allowed for the shape is two odd points, only two, okay? If the shape has more than two, it will be impossible to be solved. If just the two, it's fine. Like this shape here, a simple one. Here I have two, two of the odd points. One here, the other is here. So we can draw that with a single stroke. Okay? Like going this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, or any other way. Okay, but in all the solutions, you need to start with one of the odd points and end at the other. If you start from place like this, for example, you go this way, this way, this way, this way, you cannot go back. So you failed, okay? Now let's see our problem again. 
we need now to ask ourselves how many odd points we have in the figure. If the figure has more than two, it's impossible to be solved. So let's count. Here is an odd point. Here is an odd point, odd point. So this figure is not, is, is, cannot be solved. I have the center here is even point, no problem with even, but you can't allow more than two odd points. The other figure is also odd. All of them odd, 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 all of them. So you can start anyway, uh, but you cannot end it properly. You will need that. It's impossible to be solved as well. In this cylinder, if I consider this point is even, this point is also even. This one here is odd. This one here is odd. So it can be solved because it has only two. Only two odd, can we solve that? Yes, but you are allowed to start with one of the odd points and the end at the other odd points. So go that way, go that way, go that way, and then draw the whole circle, okay? That means it's solved now without going through the same edge twice. About this uh, pentagon star, uh, we have all points even. That's a nice one. It looks complicated, but it can be done. How? Like start anywhere you want, from anywhere you want. It has no e odd points at all. All the points here are even. So we can start like this one, this one, this one, this one, okay, sorry for that. I'm just using that mouse pen. Can you see that? And we end, mm -hmm. nice drawing, very bad, okay. Okay, that's much better now. And the other one here, how many odd points? Can you see that? I have even here, four, even, even, nice, even. Oops, odd, odd. So these two points should be one of them as a start, one, one as end. Otherwise, you cannot solve it. You can start at one of the red points and the end at the other. If you start from any other even points, it cannot be solved. If we start from here, we go that way, that way, that way. And okay, you can imagine now it's solved. Okay, you can now uh, challenge your friends with any shape and you know the secret. Like you can draw a star like this, for example. And uh, this one has all points even and then um, join two of these vertices to create two odd points. This one cannot be solved unless you start from here and end from here. Uh, you know that secret and you can leave the challenge to your friends. Okay, I hope you got the meaning. Why is that? This is Euler concept. Why Euler said that? He said simply that each point or each line segment has an end and a start. So at the same point, you have to have equal number of ends and starts to solve the figure. If uh, end number of ends and starts are equal, so the number of edges meeting there should be an even. If the point have more ends than starts, the number should be odd. It can be have one start more or one end more, but it, can, it cannot have more than that. So if the figure have two odd points, that means the number of starts and the number of ends in the figure is not in equilibrium case. So we cannot draw the figure. But if it all even points, we can draw. If it has like uh, two of the odd points, we can still draw that more than two of the old points, it's impossible to do that. Very simple, very brilliant. I hope that you enjoy it. Thanks for watching. See you next video.